Good day, mates. You are looking at one of the best kept secrets. I think it's one of the best kept secrets here in Adelaide, and maybe not to the uh, not maybe not to the locals, but certainly to tourists like me. I had never heard of this place until last night. I was searching for the best beaches in Adelaide, and this one came up. This is Henley. Surrounded by a range of high-end seafood restaurants and centering around a bustling grass square, Henley is a must-visit vis whether you're after a quality dinner, a quality swim, or a bit of both. The shoreline stretches as far as the eye can see with plenty of space for laying out your towel or taking a dip. And I pulled in here not really quite sure what to expect. And I gotta tell you, to say that I am uh, pleasantly surprised would be a little bit of an understatement. I had just come from up the coast to another beach that's considered one of the better beaches, and that would be Semaphore. And uh, interestingly enough, I was kind of expecting a little bit of the same, but the contrast between that town up there, Semaphore, and this town is like night and day. It really is. Now, I don't know if these are private residential units up here or, or rentals or a combination of both, but it's right over the, uh, the Henley Square Pavilion. And uh, I just went inside there and they've got just a stunning, beautiful supermarket and a butcher and a baker. And I don't know if they had a candlestick maker. I didn't see one, but it uh, wouldn't surprise me. But this is just really, really beautiful. And I'm kind of torn between wanting to walk down the main street first or just uh, head over to the beach. Over here, they've got a, a restaurant called Melt. And maybe I will uh, catch that on the way back. And I think I'm gonna spend a little time in this town and not even not even uh, leave without taking a dip into the into the beautiful water. Oh, it's gorgeous! What a wonderful first impression this little town Henley makes. Really gorgeous. I think I'm gonna do a. Uh, I think I'm gonna walk. Well, I'll walk over here. I'll show you the. I'll show you that mural on the side of the building here. Look at that beautiful mural right there. Isn't that gorgeous? Try to give you a nice, nice view of that. There you go. Look at that view. Wow, really beautiful. All right, I'm going to come back out here to the main, main street and entered the, the beach area through the, the large, large grass square. They really have some beautiful shops here. And I'm looking for a place to go spend the, the weekend next weekend. And this could be uh, a very good option. Come this, uh, come up this way, we're probably about Oh, I would imagine by car 15 maybe 15 minutes from maybe 15 minutes from uh, downtown Adelaide and there you see the Ramsgate Hotel right over there which seems to be a rather old building look at that 1897 that building was was built and I'll give you a view back down the street this way but look at this look at this beautiful square right here looks like there's a nice place over there to get yourself some ice cream and refreshments oh this is very nice here you can get there's a confectionery and refreshments. Malobo is the, uh, the name, I believe. That building is from 1890. Look at 
that. Oh, this is uh, actually summertime right now. Just beautiful. Really, really pretty. Fantastic. Look at all the kids playing in the in the fountain right here. Wow. Just beautiful. Look at the the benches that they have that are like waves. Gorgeous. Definitely a nice, uh, definitely a nice place. Here they have a, you can download the, the free, the free app and experience yesterday's Henley Beach. Wow, this, uh, this beach stretches for quite a while. The gentleman on his uh, rollerblades. Look at that. I'd imagine there probably is a lot of history at this beach. Boy, as far as the eye can see, there's nothing but beautiful sand. Look at that. Right now I'm just going to walk out onto the Walk out onto the jetty here. I don't know, it wouldn't surprise me. It seems that jetties seem to serve as a as a bit of a magnet for uh, young kids that wanna wanna jump off. Boy, just as far as the eye can see, look at that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna find my way in that water. And that water just is beautiful. Just clear as can be. Look at that view. Here's your view back at the at the square. I would imagine that's some pricey real estate right there along the along the beach up there. It's not very deep at all. Maybe out out here toward the the end of the jetty might be a little bit a uh, little bit deeper. Uh -huh. Out here it looks like you have some lifeguards out on the their surfboards give you another view looking looking back I don't know how well you can see that water but it is clear it is just beautiful absolutely gorgeous oh and sure enough they are jumping off the end down here so I'm sure that's uh, 
sure I'm going to be doing that here shortly. Oh, fantastic. Look at this. <laughs> this is quite a uh, quite a spot if you want to be jumping off. Wow. Fantastic. Oh, they're just jumping off anywhere. That's something. Look at that. Wow. I don't know if I'll uh know if I'll fit in or not, but uh we got steps going right up there. Look at incredible. Get us some film, mate. Get us some film. Yeah, yeah. Hey, brother. Alright, so let's uh, come up uh, here just a little bit here. Look at this. <laughs> oh, what a place to what a place to grow up. What a place to grow up. Look at this. Talking about a place to grow up, this really is, this really is something. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for a swim myself, without question. Look at that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna find my way into that water, even though I may not be in the, uh, may not be in the age range. But who cares, I'm a kid at heart. Wow. Fantastic. It really is. This really is fantastic. Look at these guys coming out. To be young again, huh? Wow. This is, oh, what a sight to behold. This guy's almost flashing. It's almost flashing me up here. Wow. All right, I gotta go get my. I gotta go get my suit. <laughs> well, here we go. <laughs> here we go again. You know, letting my uh, letting my kid at heart get the uh, get the better of me. And this is going to be a wonderful experience, or so I, so I hope this is going to be a wonderful experience. I'm, uh, I'm looking forward to it. And you know, as I, uh, as I head out there, one of the things that was going through my mind was the, uh, the years of travel, if not just the years of life, have brought forth uh, a lot of what we call, or I call, well, you could call it is, is the same, street smarts. You know, street smarts. And I, uh, one of the things you think about, you always think about when you're traveling, is you know the the security of your of your wallet, your keys, your phone, and all that kind of stuff. And I know this is Australia, and I know this is a beautiful, beautiful coastside town. But uh, but you never know. You just uh, you just never know. So I left all my stuff back in the. Uh, I left all my stuff back in the car with the car with the car unlocked. So everything is uh, everything is back uh, everything's back in the car. Yeah, and I'm gonna go out and I'm gonna jump. I'm gonna try to jump off the uh, the pier and let one of the let one of the young kids down in the water film me from uh, from down below. And uh, you know I've got my bag here, my Costco my Costco cooler bag and uh, <laughs> it's a dual purpose you know they don't they don't market it that way they could they very well could mark the uh, the Costco cooler bags as a dual purpose bag you know like a beach bag and a cooler bag but they don't but uh, anyway so I've got my bag with my uh, I've got my bag with my stuff in it and uh, there's not a thing in that bag that I couldn't live without so here we go we're gonna uh, we are gonna have some 
we're gonna have some fun and uh, I'm looking I'm really really looking forward to it I think the same kids will probably probably still be out here we will uh, we will see so I found my way out here and uh, this is this is Nate and uh, who, 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 uh, this is uh, who is this Nate? I'm Jack. Are you guys all blokes? Are you all, you're all, you're all, you're all blokes? Are y'all are y'all friends? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now you said you said that you got one of these GoPros, right? And you know how to turn it on and and you're gonna be able to get me coming down and and all that stuff. I'll try not to land too close to you because as much as I weigh, I'm probably gonna make a hell of a splash. Yeah, all right. Okay. They might issue a tsunami warning. You know, they might have a tsunami warning or something for Henley when I hit the water. Okay? Why are yeah. you laughing at that? You're not supposed to laugh. You're supposed to know, mate. You look good. Yeah, that's look what good, you say. Yeah. yeah, yeah, you look good. Okay, so you're gonna go down. You're gonna go down and uh, you're gonna film me jumping. The water. How's the water? Nice as. Yeah. Is there anything in the water I should be worried about? No. No. No stingers. No. There's only no been a sharks. couple of sharks around. There been sharks around here? Yeah. Get out of here. You'll be right. There's a shark plane, so if there's one, they'll, there's they'll surf it. There's a shark plane? Yeah. And what do they do? Is they get out of the water? They have a siren and stuff, so. No kidding. Yeah. Have you ever seen a shark in the water out here? Yeah, saw one off the jetty. You did, huh? Yeah. Was it a big one? Yeah, it was all right. <laughs> All right. All right. So you're going to go in and this is, uh, you'll just wrap this thing around your hand and then catch me jumping. Yeah. Here we go. Now, do we, people dive off of this thing? Well, you can, but I you, don't. You don't dive off of it? No? Yeah. All right. You do triple backflips, right? Yeah. All right. What's your name, Nate? Yeah. All right, Nate. Sounds good. All right. So let's, uh, you're going to go in and then you got to get me jumping all the way down and, and right into the water and then film me when I come up. Yeah. All right. Sound good? Sound like a plan? Yeah. Should I wear my hat? Oh, if you want. All right, sounds good. All right, so Nate, listen, you're going to get yourself jumping in, all right? You're just going to hold this thing real steady, all right? And then jump and then make a funny face as you're going down. Yeah, Okay, right. like you're scared or something, all right? Sound good? Yeah. All right, here we go. All right. Here goes Nate. And Whoa. All right, everyone. Here we go. This is top. This is a lot higher. This is a lot higher than it looks, but uh, I'll give it my staff. Oh, okay. I hold it steady, Nate. People dying up. That is awesome. That is really, really good. All right, here we go. Look at this. Oh, <laughs> oh, fantastic. Come on. Come on, mate. Let's do it. Yeah. Fantastic. Whoa. <laughs> oh, this is great. Yeah. Only on Tom TV. Oh. oh, this is just wonderful. Let's see the girl do it. Come on. There we go. Oh, wow. This. You're going to go? There he goes. There's Nate. <laughs> oh, this is, this is good. This is really, really good. And the water. Oh, the water. The water's fantastic. The water. <laughs> oh, the water is just absolutely fantastic. All right, I gotta find my way up to the top. I know exactly what you're thinking. You're thinking to yourself, you're all wet, mate. <laughs> and you're right. I am. Uh, I am all wet. And, uh, oh wow, what a way, you know, if you're a kid, what a way to spend the summer, you know, just absolutely incredible. You can see all the kids come down here and they bring their, they bring their bags and they, uh, they bring their bags and all their stuff, so to speak, and then they come and they just 
they just spend the day here jumping off the jumping off the jetty. Absolutely fantastic. All right, here we, here we go again. I'm going to do I'm going to do another jump and um, I'm going to share it with you. I'm going to share it with you as I go down and I'll show you the look at the look at the uh, look at the view down. You see there is your uh, if you were here that, that's your view looking down right there. So it's uh, it's fairly high and I actually I actually touched the bottom last time but uh, anyway <laughs> everybody here everybody here is watching me. You see they all they're all watching. Okay. Nobody but nobody's mooning me this time. All right. So here, here we go. Oh, goodness gracious. Do a flip. Uh, do a flip? Yeah. No, I'm just, I'm lucky I can just jump, mate. All right, so here, here we go. I'm going to try to hold the camera. Ready, set, go. Whoa! <laughs> oh, that was fantastic. Oh, that was really really fantastic and this water this water is just out of this world it is really really wonderful uh, if you come to adelaide you gotta you gotta reach the beach as in henley beach it is just a fantastic place well now that I, now that i've finished the uh the jetty experience i'm gonna walk and talk down the beach for a little bit and wrap this video up and as i do look at these look at these folks playing uh playing volleyball they they're playing it with anything but their hands they just uh as you'll see here in a moment he's just gonna kick he's just gonna kick it see and there they look at that they're using their they're using their chest their hands their head everything but their uh everything with their feet so I'm gonna just take you for a walk down the beach and this is uh, this is the holiday weekend this is the Australia Day holiday weekend Australia Day being Tuesday today being Sunday and I would imagine maybe on Australia Day this beach is gonna be even even more crowded than it is today but it is just really nice boy what a what a nice community what a really really nice community and here you see the surf uh, surf club right here the life of the beach you got your surf rescue all set up in there in their tent right there looks like there's a changing of the changing of the guard so to speak as in the surf uh, surf rescue guards so they actually have a plane that flies around looking for sharks and there will be sharks out in the water from time to time and uh, surprised they didn't sound the alarm when I uh, when I hit the water Wow, this is just really wonderful. Give a big shout out to Ronnie Redlick up in, uh, well, Boardman or Youngstown, Ohio, or wherever it he, wherever Ronnie may find himself watching this. Ronnie, you got to get yourself some of this oceanfront property. I'm telling you, you know, it's well within your capacity to do so, Ron. And we'll. Uh, We'll uh, put some steak and some some prawns on the Barbie, and uh, have a have a Foster's as we uh, watch the sun go down. And Henley would probably be a nice place to have a a Handel's ice cream, I would imagine. Boy, this is nice. This is really beautiful. All right, I'll walk a little bit further down. All right, I decided to do a little uh, little swimming swim and talk you can see there's uh, quite a quite a few people here I need to get myself one of those one of those paddle boards boy look at this we're just having having a good time 
<laughs> Very nice. It's not very deep at all. I'm just, uh, I'm not even, I'm not even up to my waist right here. There's a gentleman on a paddleboard, and I'm, uh, that's the next thing that I want to get is one of these paddle boards that this gentleman out here is on. I want to get myself one of those. An inflatable one, perhaps. Look at him, he's just uh, near effortless going along there in the water. Wow, wonderful. Gee, the water's a little bit, uh, water's a little bit cooler right here. And I don't know how well you can see this, but there is a massive fire going just off in the distance. If you can actually see that, maybe I'll just hold the camera still for a moment and then zoom in when I'm editing the, uh, the camera. But boy, that's a massive fire that's going. Wow. Quite the... Uh, Wait the sight to see that, and not the sight that you want to see here on a holiday weekend. All right, you know, I've got a uh, opportunity. I found myself a, uh, well, I'd say that you're a beautiful Australian, but I don't want your husband to get mad. That's your husband, right? Yeah, that's my husband. I don't want him to get mad at me. But you, you're a lovely lady. What's your name? Zena. Zena? Zena. Zena. Like yes. Z I I N A. Zena. Zena. And you are a, you're a true blue, genuine Aussie. Well, I right? am. I was born here. You yes. are? Have yes. you been to America? I have. You I have? Yes, we have. And we, we, did you tour all over America? Yeah, we toured all over. You did? Yes. yes. Now, we hired a car. We flew. We, you did, We've huh? traveled in the days when you could get an around the world airline ticket. And it didn't uh -huh. matter, uh -huh. you know, how long you flew for. You right. just had to keep moving around in the same direction. So we would fly all the way north. Wow. And come all the way south, and then all the way north, and all the way south. And we wow. zigzagged our way up and down the states. You like a you like a challenge, Zena? Well, yes. You do. Well, it depends. Describe Americans in one word. Oh, very one word. Right. One, one word, Zena. Right. Just one word. You're up for the challenge, right? Polite. Polite. That's if a I had to word. choose a uh, if I had to choose a second word, <laughs> I would say. Um, well spoken. That's two words. There's one word. They're articulate. Articulate. Well, okay. We're we're articulate. So, anyway, tell me, walking around the beach with a hat like this, is it is it pretty easy to see that I'm a tourist? No. 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 With my... <laughs> no. On Tuesday, we'll all be wearing that. <laughs> so what do we what do we have here? You're gonna you're gonna let me you're gonna let me do your your paddle board, are you? Yes. Look at this. Now you live here. Before I before I try the paddle board. You live right along yes, but we don't say this we row of houses, though. You live somewhere along That's this right. row of houses. Over there. Fantastic. And and you've lived here for quite some time. Yeah, 30 years. But look, can you get the fire in the background? I got the fire. I was, talking, I was talking about the fire a little bit earlier. That's but you, but enormous. you're a resident here in Henley. It's yes. a wonderful place. I, I'm just quite impressed. I, I've been staying down in Glen Elg. And then I took a drive up today to, uh, what is it, the beach just north here with the S, uh, so... Uh, semaphore. Yeah, Semaphore, I was there, and then I thought I'd come check out Henley. So let's see if I can do this. Can you hold this camera for me? So I'm going to try this. It, it, it's quite easy, you see? You just hold that, or maybe you want to hold this. You just hold that just like that, you see? You can yep. see me in there? Yep. And then when I get out there and I'm all done, you just push this top button and it'll turn off. I okay. push that top button one time I'll come in a bit and shallow. it'll turn off. Do I stand up both feet at the same time? 
easier. One leg first. I put my hands by the side of the board and then get my feet up and then I can go to the The, now let's see if Zena can do this here. Let's, don't turn it off here. Let's let's see the pro do this. Show me how it's done. Show me how it's done. Come on. Let's see. Let's see. <laughs> you're a beginner, huh? All right. Well, you're probably you're probably better than I am. I'm gonna make you a star, Zena. You know, I am gonna make you a star. This is Australia's Got Talent. <laughs> Look at you! Look at you! That is fantastic! You're a star! A star is born! Good on you! Good on you! Look at that! Wow! I'm impressed, Zena. I'm impressed! And that coming from a guy that can ride a unicycle. <laughs> Come on back this way. You know how to steer that thing? Wow. Zena, that is wonderful. You know, well, be careful. You know, meeting you was the highlight of my day. You know, definitely the highlight of my day. So, Tom, are you staying in hotels and Airbnbs? Yeah, I'm staying in, in the city center. All right, so let's, uh, here we go. Well, I've got some oceanfront property, and it's not in Arizona. You're looking at a, uh, that's a fourplex right there in that unit on the bottom left. It just uh, just sold for under, uh, under a million, and that would be Australian dollars, so probably the better part of about 700,000. But I thought I would just uh, give you a nice little view of some of the water, from some of the uh, waterfront property that you might see here in uh, beautiful Henley and uh, it is uh, it's a mix it's definitely quite the uh, quite the mix as compared to up in uh, up in Brighton where I'm gonna go sit and watch the sunset tonight and have a little have a little dinner so you can see they've got newer homes along the newer homes along the uh, Esplanade here and uh, and older homes, so quite the uh, quite the mix, as you can see. You can always Google Henley Real Estate if you're so inclined, and get a better idea as to what uh, what properties, type of properties are available here, and what the uh, what the prices are.